This film is dedicated to the memory of Hands Together's general manager, Jean Lefette Nelson, murdered on March 5th, 2012. Visitors to Haiti are overwhelmed with images. Beauty. Poverty. Vibrant life. Earthquake traces. Tent cities. Determination. Energy. Life, prayer, joy, sorrow, loneliness, inquisitiveness, wonder, reaching out, color, simplicity, Heartbreak, hunger, dedication, friendship, happiness, filth, connections, security, thrills, challenges, service. Resting, simplicity, new life. How many chickens could you carry to market? Haiti is one giant swap meet. Graphic images, many of them, projects, that Hands Together started and developed. Grammar schools, village schools like T.D. Doon, bringing education to the rural poor. Simple encounters create solidarity with people thousands of miles distant. The rebuilt high school a computer lab with desktops which we sent. Basic hygiene. Feeding programs. The students, the elderly. Drilling wells. Providing life-giving water. Always planning. Always dreaming of new ways to help the poor. This year we see many of our dreams coming true. A mango plantation. Near Basin and collaborating with the local cooperative, Father Gerard is developing a 10-acre mango plantation in the middle of the desert. Already that land has been cleared and tilled, a fence constructed and two wells dug. The next steps will be a pump house and a web of irrigation pipes with small sprinklers. Meanwhile, a thousand mango seedlings are being prepared to grace the plantation. The seedlings have been grafted onto healthy mango branches, enabling a mango crop within two years instead of six or seven years. The mangoes will be exported to the United States to bring in much needed capital. A visionary dream worthy of the long range thinking of Father Gerard. Even further along is the Clark Model Farm. Now, a little over two years old. 
This is the sight today. Bananas, carrots, melons, tomatoes, all sorts of fruits and vegetables. The Mandala Project teaches a family to sustain itself on a tiny plot and is a powerful inspiration to farming families. The farm hosts groups of farmers from poor villages and also provides a two-year agriculture degree for young people. All of Hands Together Farming is organic. No pesticides or chemical fertilizers are used. Again, part of the dream for the future of Haiti. Some are little dreams. In the community center of Basin, the local cooperative meets. Their leader discusses microfinancing with the women who watch the money. A loan from the cooperative credit union of 15 or 20 dollars can build a future for their families. Almost 500 families participate. Their default rate is less than 3%. Women dreaming. In our remote village of Tidi Dun, where a Holy Family School now proudly stands, another dream is materializing. Medical care is now available for the first time in the village's history. The Hands Together Mobile Clinic travels all the way from Port-au-Prince to address the medical needs of the community. The villagers, especially the mothers and infants, wait patiently by the hour for an opportunity to see the doctor for many of them, it is a first. In Port-au-Prince's Cité Soleil slum, another breakthrough is taking place. Literacy classes for the elderly. The old adage, it's never too late to learn, becomes, it is never too late to dream. Isn't it a marvel that in the waning years of your life, you have the courage, the energy, the determination to learn your ABCs. Through hands together, there is hope in Haiti. Some images haunt us. But the images that linger the longest are the images of smiling faces. Smiles are a sign of hope. With a smile, a lot will fall into place. Hands Together is making many of the people of Haiti dream and Smile. Mom.